Growing up with speech impediments themselves, our next guests have set out on a mission to inspire and start conversation that will help the listener understand more about speech impediments and how to overcome them. Joining me now from Beyond the Stutter podcast are co-hosts Vondell Pilcher and Antoine Albert. Vondell, Antoine, thank you both so much for joining us here today. Thank you for having thank us. You. Thank yes. you. <laughs> so excited to talk about Beyond yeah. the Stutter podcast. Yes. Uh, but before we get into the podcast, mm -hmm. I have to ask what inspired the two of you to come together and create it in the first place? Um, look, I would say what really, what really, what really inspired us is, is, is really a, like our life. Um, is as for so long, um, we lived in, like in this type of shadow almost mm -hmm. where it's where people did not really, really, really understand how we lived, you know, um, the average struggles mm -hmm. that yeah. we had to, is, is we had to like overcome yeah. and, and also just, just, you, you know, um, yeah. Mm -hmm. What really worked past it? Yeah, you know? yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So when the two of you came together and you decided yeah. this is a way that we can help spread the word For to sure. others and inform yeah. them, kind of of ways that we overcame yeah. maybe some of the struggles that you guys went through. Yeah, uh, how did that come together? Yeah, I mean, I think like I mean, I'm, I'm from Alaska. I was born and raised, and so when oh, I moved wow. to the Bay, so when I moved to the Bay, you know, I met Antoine. Antoine was actually the first person that I met who had a speech impediment, and so um, it was kind of crazy because you know. Um, I mean, it's kind of we met, but we can, I mean, we can really relate on, you know, what it feels to have a stutter. You know, I think growing up, or we both growing up, like, you know, um, it's hard, you know, to be able to speak. And, you know, we have a lot of doubts a lot of the times, like, man, we can't speak or we can't say certain words. Or sometimes, you know, we have to walk away from, mm -hmm. you know, an environment because we can't get the words that we really want to say. So I think that mm -hmm. um, as time went on, you know, me and Antoine encouraged each other, like, hey, man, we got to continue to keep speaking because there's days where, where, where we want to quit. There's days where we don't like our voices or mm -hmm. there's days where we're just so lost and depressed on some days we're just like, man, can we ever, can we ever, can we ever uh, continue to keep speaking or can we even overcome mm -hmm. um, the obstacles of stuttering and, and not losing hope in that because it could be easy to, I mean, right, we, we all have voices. And so, mm -hmm. you know, it, our voices actually makes us who we are. And so our relationship in a way, our friendship helped us um, overcome the doubt of like, man, we don't, like we can continue Getting, we, we, can, we can continue struggling together, and I think also other people in the world, I think that, like, you know, we encourage those, like, hey, we want to encourage the world that, you know, you, you don't have to give up either. You can mm -hmm. continue to keep going because a lot of people that are trapped in their, in their fear of insecurities are, are they good enough to speak? Right. And yeah. so we want to, so even though we're not, you know, see, we're in the same struggle, but we want to inspire those, like, hey, we can relate to you and that we want to encourage you to keep going as well and not give up on your voice because your voice matters. That's so wonderful too. Mm -hmm. And you're right, both of your voices do matter. Mm -hmm. And I'm so glad that you're using <laughs> that message to send out to so many people out yeah. there. Yeah. So what are some of the contents that people can find within your podcast? I know you just mentioned inspiration and kind yeah. of telling your story, yeah. mm -hmm. but what do you hope people take away from this? Yeah. Um, like I would say there is the biggest takeaway will be, be um, will be really being yourself yeah. like your weakness mm -hmm. your weakness you know mm -hmm. be, <laughs> exactly is because people always people always say like look I'm not too good at this I'm not too good at that mm -hmm. it's, but it's really a superpower yeah. at the end of the day because of that's what makes mm -hmm. you so special? Yeah, no, no, so and unique. You yeah, are. Exactly. of course. And even oh no, please. I was, go ahead. I, was, I was about to say too. I think even to our podcast is able to educate. You know, I think also educate. You know, I mean, I'm going to school to become a speech therapist. I'm in my master's degree. I start in August. But congratulations, I appreciate it. So like, even too, I want to educate. You know, also you know the SOPs out there that are learning how to help patients who also stutter. You know, so our podcast can be able to influence the SOPs out there that want to mm. learn. What does a person who stutters like? What does he go through? Right. You know, it's easy for you know. I know SOPs. We can focus on behavior, but it's I, it goes deeper than that. And I think it goes to the emotions, the insecurities, the thoughts, mm -hmm. and 
that's also a way to also help someone unlock, I mean, their confidence is when you dive into those, those deep areas with them. So I think the podcast will help them educate them as well. And even, Absolutely. and so, yeah, so that's yeah. ways that, that the podcast can do. Well, besides the podcast, the two of you have also been inspiring kids out there. I know right. you guys talked to a couple kids at schools yeah. and have been able to interact with them in that way. How did yeah. the kids receive that? Um, they received it like they was really shocked and they <laughs> yeah. was so amazed. Yeah. Like, wow, like you did this mm. and that. Um, how can I be be in you guys' shoes? Yeah. Um, that that's the, the biggest reaction. Mm. That is that I seen personally. Um, it, l l like and super impactful too. Absolutely. Mm. And what about from what did you notice? Yeah, I'm just gonna say you know because we actually went there to actually talk about you know bullying you mm -hmm. know and so it was pretty cool to share you know I mean Antoine and I've always I mean we've been across people who make fun of people who stutter so we were sharing mm. them like. Even I mean, even to you know, I mean, and we both. I mean, Tuan played football at Cal. I played quarterback at Chabot College, and so it's even inspiring to see, or not even inspiring, but it's also cool that we can relate like them. That we're we're yes. nowhere near better than them. Right. And so I think it's cool to just be able to encourage them, like, hey, no matter what, if you even get bullied for speech impediment, even just you know, I know as young kids we all just you know, as very young we make fun of each other, but it's even cool to see that you know mm -hmm. that. Those, those kids can be themselves. That is so incredible. I just <laughs> love the work that the two of you are doing, and I know it's impacting our youth in such a, a positive way. Sure. Really quickly, before I let the two of you go, where yeah. can people catch up on your podcast and just hear from more of you, you two? Yeah. I mean, I think, I mean, one be, is YouTube. You know, uh -huh. if you type in <laughs> Beyond the Stutter, you know, that would be on there too. Also on Instagram as well, uh -huh. at Beyond the Stutter. You know, so we're still getting get, we're still getting that content out there it's taking a little bit of time yeah. but you know we have some exciting we have some exciting uh, episodes and podcasts you know coming soon so incredible be patient with us please absolutely <laughs> well listen yeah. the two of you are doing incredible things I again that. thank you so much for impacting our youth thank you. in a positive way and spreading your message because i think this is a message more people need to talk about so thank sure. you both thank you so thank much you. appreciate it of course <laughs>